What's going on my friends? I hope you're very well. I hope you're having a very good start of the week. Today we're going to be working on this little guy. It's one of my uh, red oaks. We can see that I've already gone ahead and started working on it. So what I did is remove uh, dead leaves or leaves that have been damaged by the sun like this one. Yeah, and I've done some pruning. Now, why I started doing pruning is rather interesting. So these leaves have been damaged, you know, because of the sun and very extreme temperatures. But we can see that uh, because of the rainy season, because of rain and uh, lower temperatures and all of those nutrients that come with the rain, the tree has started to produce new growth. So we want that new energy. We want that extra energy that the tree has, you know, to be used in the development of the structure of the tree. Now, for example, here, I've already pruned this little guy because uh, the main line of the trunk is being hidden by this branch, or it was being hidden by this branch. I've already gone ahead and clipped some of it grow, and uh, what I'm going to do is, you know, place it like this. Now, first branch, you know, we're going to have that clear trunk line. So we're going to continue doing that. I'm going to continue doing that. I've already clipped this one as well. Can't see it very well there, but I've already clipped this one. It was longer, you know. Uh, it was going to continue to get longer with that extra energy from the rain. And so we don't want that. We don't we want... Uh, like I said, ramification. We want to clip the tips so we get back budding. And yeah, that's basically the order of business for today and for this little guy. So I'm going to continue doing that. If I have any interesting notes or things that I want to talk to you about regarding the design or regarding some of the things that we do, uh, I'm going to, you know, Pause the video. I'm gonna show you. Uh, yeah, but that's what I'm gonna do. So I moved closer to the top, and uh, we can see the new growth here. Um, this is gonna be the new apex of the tree. Uh, we can see that I've already cut some branches, so that these buds that we have here, you know, this one and this one, this one over here, activate and start to you know build more branches or start to push out new growth in which uh, we're gonna see those new branches that are gonna form the apex of the tree uh, this one well new growth we know the rule we leave it until it matures so we can uh, work on it but I'm gonna leave this as a sacrificial branch you know so I'm gonna cut everything except the new growth and I'm gonna leave some some branches there so that we don't get a, you know, a dead branch we're gonna leave enough foliage so that we leave it alive and uh, yeah that's what we're gonna do right so there's another branch right here we can see it here it starts to form here and we can see that it's got buds this one is uh, already started to grow this season. So what we're gonna do is, you know, clip and then uh, continue. Let's pause the video. Someone was pulling up to the driveway, so that's why I paused the video. But like I said, what we're doing is basically pruning back so that we get new bullets in those new areas where we need them. This, this one over here is a very good example of that. Sorry about that here. We can see that we got tons and tons of little bots that are just waiting to become active. So what we come and do is we come in with the pruners and we just clip the tip, you know, and that just signals the tree, hey, so there's a new leader in town. <laughs> you can actually tell the tree that uh, those bots can now become active, you know by pruning and so that's what we're doing today we can also actually see where that's happened before in the new growth yeah 
So here, this little bot became active because the upper leaves were becoming damaged by the sun, as we can see here. We're going to go ahead and remove this one as well. And uh, yeah, that's what we're doing this season. We can also see that some branches have been growing in funny angles. For example, here we can see a clear, a clear, sorry, a clear uh, branch, clear line. This is the main branch. Then it divides into two, and the others also divide into two. That's what we want. But here, this one has, you know, been very very slow. It hasn't developed very well, but this one has. Now what we have here is this branch growing very close to this one over here. So what we want is directed this way so that we have a back branch. Look, no back branch over there. Yeah. So that's what we can do. That's one option. And another option is taking one of these and also move it this way. You know? This is what I mean when I say funny angles, you know, this is natural in nature. Well, with huge trees that have been alive for hundreds and hundreds of years. Yeah, but, um, you know, this little guy is very, very young. Now, that being said, the trunk base is starting to get character, you know. We can see there that the bark is starting to become rough. And that's good. But, you know, we have to do some wiring so that it continues to develop in structure and this continues to become a good tree in the future yeah so i'm gonna do that i'm gonna do some wiring and then uh, once the wire is in position and uh, i'm gonna continue to do that yeah so let's go ahead and do that okay so the wire is in place um i think i got a very good idea of what i want to do in some places uh but yeah we can see that you know that's Basically, what I want to do is place them in such a way that they continue to develop, but in a better location. Yeah. So that's the first one. We can see that this branch was covering this side. And uh, we don't want that, of course. Uh, so, yeah. Look at how this one, for example, is going diagonally like that. So we can bring it down. Once we wire it with this one over here. And this one is very straight. So what we can do is try and direct it a bit downwards and then... So, let me just see here, yeah, there, okay, we continue with this side, and we want this one to go to the back of the tree. This is one of the ones that I told you was growing in a funny angle. So it's now directing its foliage that way, which means it's going to receive more sunlight and will be vigorized in the process. So this one right here, it's, uh, you know, uh, it's a bit tricky, you know, because look, no branches here yeah and we got all of this space over here which is negative space we got no foliage over there so what we're gonna do I think it's break this angle a little bit and then move this one a little bit like this Again, we don't want those sharp angles there. So we're going to try and we're 
move it a little bit and then this little branch that we have here I don't know if you can see it let me see this one this little branch that we have here we can actually bring it to this negative space that I was telling you about uh, I think it looks better that way it's now over here this still not convincing enough for me this corner right there but I have to do for the moment and then let's see this little branch right here let me just remove this leaf so we can see better oh I wire this so I could move it a little bit to the side like so and then this one a little bit down like this yeah and uh, you know I think this one sorry I got a notification that's why the video paused but yeah the, the last thing I did was uh, I moved this little branch to the back so that we have more foliage there and uh, we can see that this little guy is basically finished for today uh, yeah so the branches are now in place uh, I clip the tips you can see our sacrificial branch or sacrifice branch here on the back with the new foliage we've also clipped the tips here so we get more buds you know activating here and here to the sides so we have more, more foliage there so that's pretty much it I have more oaks you know I have more red oaks English oaks so I'm gonna do basically the same thing that we did with this one uh, with the other ones and so those videos are coming up thank you for all your comments your subscriptions uh, questions anything if you have more please drop them down below I'll make sure I answer them uh, yeah if you're new to the channel subscribe I'll see you in the next one okay bye have a very good Monday